So hello everybody and welcome to today's video. Today my friends I'm very happy to be here to present you another uh, guide and today I'm going to show you how to play uh, Rocket League Sideswipe on your PC. Uh, first off um, there are two programs that you can use. Uh, the first it is uh, Nox, the second it is uh, Bluestacks. Okay. We are using Bluestacks and if you check all over the internet, uh, it is much better. I use both and uh, Bluestacks uh, is actually the one that has no glitches, that the performance is uh, just fine. The only downside to it, it doesn't look as beautiful as on Nox, but that's it, okay? On Nox you have some uh, weird audio glitches coming uh, uh, every 20 minutes, okay? And uh, you hear everything double for like 5 minutes and you can't error or it's very weird to use, okay? Uh, on uh, Bluestacks, very easy, you click on L1 by default on your uh, controller and it is just uh, working okay so how to do it okay as you can see i am on my pc playing with my controller and this guide is also if you for example you uh, want to use with your keyboard it works also so let me just close this there it goes so first thing we are gonna go to bluestacks.com i'm gonna put the link under the description don't worry okay so and then we are on this site right here or this page then we click here uh, on see all versions okay see all versions then we are redirected to this site we scroll down to here okay bluestacks 5 nougat 64 bit and that's the version that we want. We don't want the 32-bit because then it's not going to work. And 64-bit beta, don't take this one. Okay, so download here and it's going to start. Okay, as you can see, I already uh, tried out uh, to see if it works before I do the video because I had... Uh, a previous uh, version uh, but i have uh, downloaded it and so it uploads also okay uh, your current version that you have installed on your pc okay so and then you open your file then you click on yes and you are gonna go uh, lounge and everything we are not gonna go over that okay it's gonna start at zero percent until 100 percent you have to wait like five minutes until you download 600 mb i think uh and then you are good to go okay so when you have done that you will have like let me just take them here you will have those three icons okay you are gonna click on bluestacks 5 to start this okay it's gonna start uh take a while okay uh, until it launches okay maximize always uh, we are waiting just a bit and it's already started normally for you it's gonna like take one minute the first uh, time so and now what we, are we gonna do we are gonna go to play store okay the first time you will do that he is gonna ask you to sign in with your google um account okay if you have no google account you will have to make one or create one you can do that on your pc maybe it's easier uh, than doing it here okay and then you have to sign a, uh, sign in with your uh, google account it's totally safe you can do it as you can see i'm also logged in okay when you have done that uh, you are logged in and then you do just like i did now uh, you click on play store and then here you write side swipe as you can see i already did it so side swipe there you go you see it here and then here it's gonna be written download you're gonna download easy okay it's gonna take a, uh, uh, like five minutes and you have your game on your uh nox or uh, on your blue stack sorry so then you will have this icon right here okay you click on this and then you already see it's launching easy and you are good to go okay something that is like um good to know is uh, also the first time that you launch this on your blue stacks uh he's gonna ask you to log in with your epic um account or any other account so uh, you will do that too and then if you're uh, using your controller here okay or your um, keyboard it doesn't matter um, you can then change the 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 um, the buttons okay that you want to use uh, while you're playing so to do that you click here on game controls okay you have to activate on screen and then you have 
or we are going to use our keyboard or we are going to use our controller. Both of the options are pretty much the same. We click on open advanced editor and then you see already, okay? We have here the buttons by default and you don't need uh, to uh, create any other. To create, you click on left and then you uh, click on your um, the button that you want to assign to it. For example, tri triangle and we have it already here, but we don't want it. So uh, I'm just gonna close this very quick no discard okay so here and then advance like let's say here it's the jump when you are playing uh we want to change it to uh to circle we click on this i click on circle and it's done okay but we don't want that i want back to x okay uh, no sorry to circle exactly and then we save and you're good to go and you will see it's very easy uh when you want to um like uh, change your um <clears throat> your buttons okay or your key binds uh, for your um for your uh, controller while you play okay that uh, was it okay wait and then the other thing also you want to uncheck on screen the screen control so that you don't see that okay those little buttons that are a bit uh, worth to see on screen and game controls you can also take that out okay then you will see we go to free play and then it's just beautiful okay you don't see any buttons on your screen okay so that was it my friends i mean i know it was a bit uh, uh, of a long uh, guide but i wanted also to talk about how to bind your um, your buttons okay because in my opinion it's very important to know okay so uh, my friends um, thank you so much for watching i hope it was um, it was helpful okay if you want to see more guides like that don't forget to like don't forget to comment don't forget to subscribe and for the rest thank you so much for watching have a nice day nice night and see us on the next uh, video or on the next stream that we are always streaming on twitch so bye bye my friends love you bye